Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have my little baby bear with me. Huh. Hi. So, for today's video, I don't know if you guys have noticed, but barrettes and like hair clips are a big thing right now. Um, and some people love them and some people it's not for them. Um, but they're actually like really easy to make. Or at least it's easy to make really cute and kind of unique hair clips. So, if you're into that and you like this trend going on right now, um, I'm going to show you three different, just super easy uh, ways you can make your own hair clips. So if you're interested to see that, then just keep on watching. Okay, so the materials I use for all of these projects are hair clips, and I use ones that are two inches long, and I also used E6000 glue. Okay, so for this first project, you're going to need some modeling clay. So I just went to a craft store and picked out a few colors that I liked. And the good thing about this is you can honestly be just as creative as you want to be. So I'm just doing kind of an easy design. I'm just taking some white modeling clay, um, rolling it out so that'll be long enough to fit my clip. And then I'm just going to take a, another color, this pretty pink, rose pink color, and I'm just putting these like tiny dots of the clay all over just to kind of give it that spotty effect um, that I think is super cool, but you can honestly do any pattern um, that you want and make it look however you want, which I think is super cool. Um, so yeah, I'm just taking this, making little dots everywhere, and then smoothing it all down with my rolling pin. And then to measure it out, honestly, it probably would have been better if I would have just like used a ruler and an exacto knife to make these straight edges but I th this worked fine um so I'm just taking my scissors or an exacto knife would work better and I'm just trying to cut out the clay as evenly as possible so that it will fit onto my clip so as you can tell, it's a very skinny piece of clay that I need. Um, so you can make a lot of hair clips, which is super fun. So I think I got about five out of this little piece of clay. Um, so then I just line them all up. And this is oven baked clay, so I'm going to bake it just for how long the instructions say on my package. And then they come out and they should um, be firm and not bendable. And then I'm just taking my glue and just gluing them straight on to my hair clips. Okay, so for this next one, I've seen a lot of clips with pearls on them, so that's what I was gonna show you guys how to make. But then when I went to go get pearls, I found these super pretty glass pink beads instead. So I went for these, but it's basically the same thing. You can get pearls if you want. Um, but basically, I just found these strings of beads and it's so simple. Honestly, I'm just gonna take my glue and glue them straight onto the hair clip. Um, these are so stinking cute. If I had to pick a favorite out of these three clips that I'm making, this one is my favorite, I think. Um, I just think they're so stinking cute. They look good on me, they look good on my daughter. Um, I just, I love them. They're so cute. There's so many different beads at the store too that you can choose from, which is so fun. Okay, so for the last set of clips I'm gonna show you how to make, it's honestly like the simplest thing ever <laughs> as well. Basically, I'm just taking some fabric. I'm going to cut a strip of fabric the size of my clip, um, but the length of it is going to be actually a little bit longer than my clip because when I glue it down, um, I'm going to glue the back sides of the clip too as well to um, fold the little strip of fabric under so that it will stay in place on both sides of the clip. And since I'm using just like normal cotton fabric, it frays a little bit, so I just went ahead and just trimmed the edges. But if you want fabric that won't fray, I think using like a leather would be super cool. Um, and then that one won't fray, so you won't have to do that bit. But So I just made a cute little blue striped one and then just a floral one, but it's honestly the simplest thing ever. And they're just like so dainty and cute. So that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you all will go 
make some super cute hair clips while it's still in style. Comment down below which of the three hair clips I made was your favorite and give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and feel free to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos from me. So that is it. I hope everyone has an awesome day and I will see you next time. Bye! Okay, bye! Bye!